I grew up in San Francisco. I love driving across the Bay Bridge and seeing the skyline come into view. I absolutely love my city by the bay. The San Francisco Flower Market was established in 1912. It is home to more than 45 different vendors. It's almost daybreak. We're finally here for our field trip to the San Francisco Flower Market. It's kind of chilly this morning. I got my badge on. It was a little bit crowded on the bridge, but we're here and it's just starting to be light out. I always bring a busing cart with me to the flower market. So I like my own busing cart with my name prominently on here so people don't steal it. My folder my, with uh, the, today's list. I usually start with a walkthrough of the market. I don't go and just grab stuff unless I have it ordered. Today, I'm not doing a very large party. I have two events coming up. I have a private party and next week I have a big design show. So. I'm gonna buy for the party and also just kind of do a look-see for what I wanna buy for the design show. So I'm just gonna do a big walkthrough. So I'm gonna look for some beautiful fall foliage here. Let's see what they have. I like the Chinese pistachio, but I think the leaves might be too big. I think I'll do the walkthrough and come back. I did pick out some beautiful uh, David Austin sprays in kind of a apricot -y yellow. I want to do fall, but a sophisticated fall, so we're going to go with deep reds and burgundies, maybe some peachy colors. So let's do the walkthrough. a wonderful uh, stall that has all the natural cut greenery. I'm going to take a look in there to see if there's any good fall leaves. Oh, look at this beautiful grapevine. Oh, gorgeous. I like the maple, but a lot of the tips are kind of brown and dead looking, so I don't love it. So let's just keep walking and see what else that we can find. The crazy thing is I've got tons of Japanese maple in my garden. In like two weeks, it'll all look like this. <laughs> this Nandina is gorgeous. I think that might be the option instead of the Japanese maple. They have plenty of it, so I'm gonna do my walkthrough and come back for it. Wow. This is one of my favorite vendors, Miguel's Flowers. Lots of great roses here, so I'm gonna take a look. So my plan was to use some deep purple, reds, and like orangey colors, but I don't know, I really love this peachy hydrangea. <clears throat> I'm undecided right now what I'm gonna do, because I'm gonna do like a hint of fall, but I don't wanna go overboard with fall, and I'm already gonna buy the peachy apricot um, spray roses, so maybe I need to go darker with hydrangeas. Anyway, I have to look around. I found more of the peach hydrangea, so I'm gonna go with that. So this is where we kind of put what we want aside, just in these cubby holes. Now that I've committed to doing like the peachy colors, with the reds, I think I'm not gonna do the purples. I'm gonna have to find maybe more burgundies. For some reason, I feel like the purples are not gonna work well with the peachy colors. This beautiful rose, pink expression. Looks like a gigantic English rose in that kind of rich pink color. This is gorgeous. Guess it won't really fit with my fall theme, huh? But I'm so tempted <laughs> to use that with the reds. Maybe I'll change my color scheme again. So 
these are some of those muted color roses that look like freeze-dried roses. That one looks like the color of the cardboard. <laughs> Not my favorite, but hey, maybe there's a use for this. Uh, the Celosia is really, really beautiful. I love that velvety red. I think this is gonna be nice. This is Torchio, one of the um, large wholesale company that has everything. It's like kind of a one-stop shop. They have everything from roses, all the cut flowers, greenery, um, everything. It's just, if I only had this, I could do my events. My, one of my favorite vendors, Torchio at the San Francisco Flower Market. this awesome black kale or black cabbage so gorgeous I want to do this for my design show but it's too early to buy it so I hope they have it later this week look at these gorgeous peonies where are they getting them in October there's a guy who just sells greenery. Let's see if he has any really cool fall foliage available. So this is what I'm looking for. Look at this gorgeous maple. Look at these colors. I love this. I think we're going to have to go with this. You can't be shy. You just kind of dive right in and go into the greenery headlong. <laughs> That's why I wear gloves. Okay, so I like this bundle here. like to check in here they also have a lot of nice stuff and props too hello good morning how are you This is how wholesale roses come. They come in a cardboard kind of sleeve with the cellophane and it's 25 stems to a bundle. So I kind of just do this, look at the colors and how they all work together with the, the fall foliage. And I think it's coming together. We're doing kind of a sophisticated fall with the fall foliage, peachy apricot, deep reds, this weird salmony color purples. I don't know if I'll use this or not. Maybe I'll just keep it for myself. Okay, great. Thank you. You ready? Hi. Uh, whatever's easiest. All right. I found some berries. <laughs> I like these.
So I'm gonna buy some of the hard goods so you could come in and take a look at what a wholesale supply house looks like. This is where you buy vases, foam, um, floral tape, floral glue, that type of stuff. There are two, two places I go to. There's this one, Mount Eden Floral, and then later on, if they don't have what I need, I will go to Floral Supply Syndicate. Well, they've got tons of beautiful Christmas right now. Look at this, all this great ribbon. <laughs> I have never seen this before. It's a plush, furry, Merry Christmas ribbon. looking for two buffet arrangement containers that are gold. This is more bronze, but it could work. Kind of like this. That's cool. The polar bear tree is really neat. I'm going to head over to Floral Supply Syndicate. the van. This is a very small trip for me for the flower market because it's just a private home party. So that's why I'm taking you guys on this trip today. <laughs> if I'm doing a full-scale wedding, I need to concentrate on buying. 